Hi folks, welcome back to GP Reactions. I hope you're well, hope you're enjoying your week, hope you've had a fantastic day. Um, I want to thank everybody that has subscribed to this channel. I want to thank everybody that has contributed in terms of comments, music suggestions, um, even down to buy me a coffee on my um, buy me a coffee um, page. Uh, everything's appreciated. I really love sure the suggestions that I get, even through the comments or through that. Um, and, and yeah, it's just, it's really blown my mind and opened my mind up to so much music, incredible music. I have like pages and pages and pages of suggestions, which I will get round to. Sometimes it inspires me to write something that I've found out as a, as a you know, a possible um, song to react to. But um, overall, you know, when I started this channel, I kind of thought I, you know, I was pretty bored with music. I thought I pretty much knew all all the music that I needed to know, but how massively wrong I was. And even some of the um, newer tracks I've reacted to, um, just absolutely amazing, you know, bands. Anyway, um, this is a band I don't know anything about. And uh, the track I'm going to be reacting to is called Fire Brigade, and it's by a band called The Move. And it was taken from their album Move uh, from March 1968. It's a debut album. Um, Indeed, this track actually entered the UK Top 40 on the 7th of February 1968, and it beats out number three, which is pretty cool. It's pretty darn good. So the really interesting thing about this lineup is that we have um, we got Carl Wayne on vocals, Roy Wood, who I've heard of on vocals and guitars, uh, Trevor Burton, who I've also heard of, and I, I, I is this is that something to do with um, the animals? Um, we've got um, Ace Colford on bass and vocals. And another person I've heard of as well, Beth Bevan, drums and percussion. I've heard of Beth Bevan because of an electric light orchestra. Um, this song was actually written by um, Roy Wood and Carl Wayne. So uh, the Fire Brigade, I'm not sure what the song's about, but I can guess. It's something to do with putting out fires. So this, I believe, is a studio version. So it might be a video. I'm not entirely sure. So I'm going to click play and, and uh, find out what it's about. What a poppy song. I really, really enjoy this and I just love in these lyrics. So, so basically it's at school. Um, he's seen a girl that he really likes and, um, but he, he hasn't quite worked out how to curb his enthusiasm for her. And I think his friends are telling him, you know, not, don't be so hasty, but he, he can't help himself. It's that adolescent, um, further that, uh, uh, that, Everybody has probably experienced a school where you really kind of got the hots for someone, and um, it's it's it can it can either go uh, very well or it's complete disaster. It's how we learn about love. I just love the fact that the fire brigade are, are gonna are gonna put water on. They're gonna uh, dampen his enthusiasm. Um, they're gonna like extinguish that flame of of passion he feels that he might have for. Um, uh, uh, a, a pupil at his school so um 
And yeah, I mean, you know, it's a bit uh, strange talking about pupils fancy each other, but we, we've all been to school. We all kind of know how it works. And, um, you know, I guess uh, in, in any day and age, you'd rather, um, the parents would rather it didn't work, that you got to just do your schoolwork and enjoyed yourself. Um, but you, as soon as you kind of reach as teenagers, you start to fancy people and, um, and yeah, you're very shy, very awkward. You don't know how to put yourself forward. And, um, you know, uh, and this is just a great, great example, uh, lyrically, of uh, of uh, how, how that kind of gets extinguished. But I was absolutely loving this. A lot of energy in his song. Um, I was saying, Roy Wood looks so young there. I, I, I'll tell you, Roy Wood used to actually go drinking at a, a wine bar. Um, I think it was in over in... Um, not too far away from where I lived, and I think he probably had a house up there. But um, you know, it's, it's my brother um, bumped into him a few times. He's such a nice bloke, so um, yeah, it, you know, heads up to. I mean, to go drinking in a wine bar, very down to earth, you know, down to earth guy. But yeah, this is great. I love this. Um, I've never heard this before, and uh, it's got so much energy. I'm just kind of um, waiting to see what this. I think we're about to go into a course. That was great. I love that. I love that bit at the end, um, vocalising the sound of fire, fire engine. Let's just take that out. Very big 52 s Yeah, that was so much fun. That was a really, really fun track. I, I, I love that. I love the lyrics as well. So I'm going to dive straight into him. Cast your mind back 10 years. Oh, so he's thinking back to when he was at school. Um, to the girl who's next to me in school. Uh, if I put my hand on her leg, which you shouldn't do, ever do. Um, she she hit me with a rule. So um, at least she can take care of herself. Um, though tomorrow won't be long, you're going to have to play it cool. You, you get fascinated by her. She could set the place on fire. I love the play on words. Run, uh, run and get the fire brigade. Get the fire brigade. See the building start to really burn. Get the fire brigade. Get the fire brigade. If you jump, you've got to wait your turn. So, you know, just kind of calm down. Don't be so hasty. Friends all seem to laugh. I fear I'm apt to make a compromise. Try to measure myself. My head must need some exercise. Half past ten in the morning. She just took me by surprise. True, she set the place on fire. You get fascinated by her. The lights across the street throw a rainbow. I'd love you all to meet her. I'll be there. I'll be there. Notice that my eyes have been a misty place since Saturday. Brings a feeling that we might lead the fire engines away anyway. Yeah, that was a really, really great track. Um, such fun. And it's great that they can capture um, a sort of snapshot of school life in... Um, We've, we've pretty much enough innocence and yes, you know, I mean, we live in an age now where even if you um, touch somebody on the shoulder, it's kind of seen as something a little bit lot worse than it actually is. But, um, you know, people were a lot hardier, I think, back in the 60s and 70s and, um, and indeed also 80s. And I think, um, yeah, none of these things were taken that seriously back then. Um so it's to me it's just a really really fun record and a great sound as well um roy wood uh such a good such a good singer and such great lyrics by 
uh, Wood and Wayne. Um, yeah, if you have any memories of this, if this kind of like rekindles some nostalgic memory for you, then please join me in the comments below. If you have any thoughts about um, the band, The Move, I'm not sure how many albums they actually did. I can't think it would have been that many because they can't have been that long before they he was part of the Electric Light Orchestra, I believe. Um, but yeah, you know, if you do anything, do know anything more about uh, this group, um, just join me in the comments below and let's read your comments. We always look forward to them. And uh, yeah, till next time, take care of yourselves. Have a fabulous week and a hopefully a great weekend if I don't talk to you before.